And welcome back, folks, to more of the Path Traveler. Uh, last time we played, we were finishing out the Chapter 3s, and we only got one left. We have the Haunted Chapter in the Still Snow. And after that, it's all Chapter 4. The final chapter is for every character that we have to do. Uh, the team's ready. We have Primrose, Haunted, Tressa, and Ophelia, all in the super overpowered classes of Starseer, Warmaster, Rune Lord, and Sorcerer. <laughs> so basically all we have to do is get the story started. The story so far. Following her master's trail, Hunnet made it. Hunnet made the long journey to Stoneguard. There, she talked to Natalia, who had been friends with Zanta. Following Natalia's clues, Hunnet found her master in the forest. Except, he had been petrified by the beast called Red Eye. Hunnet forgivest this old man for not keeping his promise. The last words he wrote before the curse stilled his hand. In the same note, he told Hanit to find a woman called Susanna. She's a seer, he wrote, and perhaps she can help. And thus does Hanit arrive in the frozen village of Stillsnow. Oh. By the spirits, the snow falleth deep here. What is it, Lind? This is not like thee to frolicken as a kitten. But then thou art a snow leopard, are thou not? For thee arriving in this white wasteland is like a homecoming. Party. I I've never seen a snow leopard that big before. Um, it, it doesn't bite, does it? Cheerily. Fear and not, young ones. Lind is with me. She is a gentle creature. She will do the doeth the no harm. Really? She's yours. Funny sort of pet, ain't she? <laughs> Lind is not a pet. She is my companion, my friend. <laughs> Friends, you say, just like us then. Yep. Oi. Yeah. Her fur is so soft. Whoa. And warm too. So. Telling me, children. Doth a woman by the name of Susanna liveth here? Hmm. The old lady? Oh, yes. The old witch, you mean? Aye, we know her. Who doesn't? Now then. I see. Where might I find her? Oh. See that house with the red roof over yonder? Heyeth there, Rusty. How you doing? Rusteth? Mm -hmm. That's the old witch's place. I see. I uh, thank thee, children. Bye! Of course, say hello to the witch for us. Bye bye. Bye boy. Enjoyeth? Enjoyed this, the attention, didst thou? <laughs> Roar. <laughs> Best come in with me then, before they return in with more friends. Alright, so we gotta find the, the witch. Lind is popular with children, isn't she? 
Yes, in our village, the younglings oft played with her. Lynn seemed to enjoy in the games as well. Nothing warms the heart quite like seeing children smile. Lind is most proud of her fur. She liketh nothing better than to be stroked and groomed. I can see that. Of course, the children liken it also to bury in themselves in her thick, warm coat. Er, yes, what is it? Do you think Lind would snap at me if I stroked her? Of course not. Willeth, wilt thou? Would I ever? Once the children have had their turn, of course. And by all means. Alright, so so far pretty straightforward. All we need to do is... See the witch. No big fights yet. Hmm. Hmm. What is this crowd? Listen up. But I have journeyed many leagues to have my fortune told by Madame Susanna. I implore you, pray open the door. The pox on him! God's teeth, man! Get out of my way! Yeah. What the? You wretched horson! Apologize at once! Boy! You won't get no apology out of old. Eliak, he don't talk none. Honestly, has he lost his tongue? No. Nay, hey, it's just that Susanna does the talking for both of them. Yeah. Blah. Oh ho. Who is that man? Doubtless. Susanna's Susanna's minder. He looks after her and keeps the riffraff from bothering her, as you may have noted. Truth is, names alike. She took him in off the streets when he was a wee sprout. Aye. Saved his life. She did. And he's been with her ever since. Hey there, Yashabe. Could that mean? Old women aren't commonly in need of a bodyguard. Mm. They are when folk from far and wide come flocking to have their fortress told. Bane don't sit too well on her. Considering how she, how little she cares for company. Surely she doth not refuseth every vi visitor. Right. Bit of a funny one, ain't it? A seer who can see the future clear as day, but don't tell no one what she knows. Alike turns them all away, and no amount of begging or beseeching makes one spit of difference. Ah, yes. Every now and then, a fool tries to get rough with Alike, but oft as not, ends up with only a cracked skull for his trouble. Curses. Finding her was easy, but talking to her may prove it the more difficult. Oh man, I think we'll have to go find some monsters. Because I know 
don't think we have much in terms of good monsters. But we'll try it, but... Hmm? Actually... We don't have counterattack. Think she can learn it. Doesn't have enough points. All right, well, let's try it. Let us begin. It. What next? Mm -hmm. We don't. No, uh, never mind. I think we do have uh, pretty good stuff here. I will not be thy prey. What next? I will not what next Leap the sword I will not be that coming if thou darest holding back nothing Let my arrow fly in two All right from here we'll do what triple next? triple axe for more damage. Yeah, there we go. Miss it's coming if thou darest. That's one coming monster gone. If thou darest. Miss it's letting the hunt begin. This should be enough. Still a boy within. Be a dear, Hannet, and have Linda carry the poor fool within. He'll be catching his death of cold lying out in the snow like a log. <laughs> How did she know? How dost thou knowest my name? How did she know That's we, what we thought that? That's what you want to ask, isn't it? I'm a seer, remember? Possessed of the all-seeing eye. Or so they say. Then thou art an oracle. Truly, thou will be able to help. <laughs> Poppycock and nonsense is all it is. Poppycock? A hunter from the woodlands who communes with the beasts. Not a common sight in these parts. The only one who might fit that description is that hobbledy hoy, Xanta. Him or his prentice, Hanet of the Darkwood. Your age, your snow leopard, your garb, simple deduction, my dear. The trick is to say what you know, and nothing more, and let the gullible fill in the details. That's all Susanna's famous all-seeing eye is, in the end. She's just a rumor monger. Well, disappointed to learn I'm just a fraud? On the contrary, now I know I can trust thee. If thou speakest the truth about this, then surely thou wouldst not speak false of aught else. Fair before you, but that Zonta lad raised a clever apprentice, and that's the truth. Now, why don't you tell me why you're here? <coughs> but first, let's go inside, shall we? It seemeth that would be for the best. Oh, 
Well, well, well. That young master of yours has managed to get himself into a right mess, hasn't he? Mistress Susanna, canst thou help in him? There is one way. In truth. Truth? Ah, now that's a word. You said you trusted me, remember? If there is the slightest chance of lifting that curse, I will trust whomever I need to. <gasps> Milady? Gods take my eyes if that fool hasn't raised a strong and brave young woman. I'd scarce believe it if you weren't standing here in front of me. I learned from his example. The good and the bad. <laughs> Is that so? Can't imagine that would work, but the world is full of wonders at that. Isn't that so, my dear? <laughs> Pop the feel there. But about the curse... I am prepared for any trial. There is but one way to turn stone back to living flesh. And that is to slay the beast that wrought the curse. I had feared as much, but it shall be done. Stay, child. I'm not finished yet. Did Santa forget to teach you patience? Mine apologies. If you try to fight the beast as you are, you'll only meet the same fate as your master. And what good will you be to him then? But I must... What you must do first is find the means to protect yourself from Red-Eye's lethal power. Tell me, dear, have you heard of the plant called Herb of Grace? Never. Long ago, there was a beast in these parts, too, what turned men to stone. Folks here soon learned that Herb of Grace could ward off the magic. I reckon it should be effective against Red Eye as well. Herb of Grace grows in a forest so thick there are few ways in. I'll send a layer ahead to show you the entrance to the trail. But know that the forest is a perilous place, and home to many frightful beasts. You want to prepare well before you venture in. I shall. Thank thee, my lady. <laughs> it is my pleasure, dear. In a strange way, that Zanta boy was like a son to me. A vexing wayward one, but a son all the same. With you being his apprentice, it rather makes you my grandchild now. And what kind of a grandmother would I be if I refused to lend you a helping hand? Master and I are both in thy debt. Grandma? Alright, let's go see if we can't uh, get some items. Get a few more plums. Overall, I think we're pretty good. We'll save, of course. Into the forest in the north. Now we should be more than okay. I think this area is like level 38. Yeah. And we're like level 60s. <laughs> I Very think we'll, we'll be okay. Oh, 
want some coal. Clean coal, of course. This is probably for a quest line that I don't know of. Oh, what do you have? Horn helm, spiked armor, spiked shield, pretty garbage, but he is blocking a door. So if we slay him. Letting us begin it. Oh, you didn't heal. Letting the hunt begin it. Miss it to me. Letting my arrow fly in truth. I do not what next. What is all this damage? Come, holding back nothing. No! Thou didst fight his was so good. So when you knock a guy in front of a door, you have access to his house. Sometimes they have pretty good gear. Swordbreaker though, probably not that great. It's decent. Not amazing. Decent. Danger level thirty seven. Yeah, we'll be okay. Do we have? Just want to be sure if we have the right skills on. Uh, extra experience and more JP. Oh, there we go. Yeah, we're more than okay now. Open for business. Letting the hunt begin. It. On the weak the dagger. Stiletto of steel. I am ready. Here are those. This guy's weak to the dark. Yeah, he's probably gonna die. Oh, it's the one. Let's do this. Um. Punish everyone. Time for a break. Coming. Yeah. Nice try. I'll not be defeated. I am ready. The show is over. Stronger than I thought. So strong, it really doesn't matter. Maybe afterwards, it's gonna make uh, a difference in chapter four. Ooh, ice dudes. My turn now. Um. Feel the power. Now, I don't think I have anything to hit with lightning with. Yeah. Here are bows. Grooming. Um. I 
We did get a fair amount of JP, which is pretty good. Shouldn't be here. Just too strong. Something I want to change, though. Now, our little... Our little Tresla here is way too slow. Hopefully, then I'll put her in a good spot there. Hey there, Freeport. How you doing? Grim whiteness, as far as the eye can see. Th Actually, I was five minutes late. Five minutes late. It is colder here too. The wind cutteth to the bone. Come on. This way. So. For those who have missed the uh, last 30 no, minutes, uh, Haunted here is looking for the Herb of Grace so she can protect herself from the Red Eye. And by defeating the Red Eye, she can free her master from the Curse of Stone. Mm -hmm. A secret path only the Mistress knows. It leads straight to the heart of the forest. Out here, the snow never melts. It covers landmarks and makes every direction look much like the other. The herb of grace grows somewhere deep in the forest. Hmm. But be wary. Many dangerous fiends lurk within. That's why Susanna keeps the knowledge of this path a secret. <laughs> so... Thou dost speak in, and as well as any man. Huh. Only when I have something to say. Thanks be to thee. Will that more people in this world followeth the same principle? <sighs> Go carefully. I have not seen Susanna look so happy for many a years. Hoppy and happy. <laughs> Pray return safely, that you might bring her more joy. Is it John Chaos? Yes. Thou hast my thanks. I owe her that much and more. I will prevail. Got some banter. Whoa, would you look at that? Snow and ice, as far as the eye can see. It's beautiful, don't you think? It is indeed. I have roamed far and wide on the hunt, but never beheld a place such as this. The snow is like a silk wedding gown, but even softer and whiter and more beautiful. A silk gown? Tell me, Tressa, couldst thou place in a price on this scene? Of course not, silly. As much as I'd like to take it home with me, a site like this can't be bought. 
there's not enough room in anyone's bag for a treasure like this. Indeed, I dare say thou art right. Have what about a picture though? Hmm? Hmm? You could sell a picture. Hey there, Mr. Anderson, how you doing? Tressa, holy cow. Let's do this. Feel the power. Letting the hunt begin. I'll not be defeated. No. Well, hopefully that doesn't kill the other guy. Yeah. Oh, we're gonna have to use a plum. Now, really, all we need to do is get trusted to heal everyone up, and we'll be more than okay for the boss. Even so, she can heal during the boss. It's not like we're going to be in any danger whatsoever. Letting my arrow fly in true. I am ready. Literally does not matter. Here's our foes. My turn now. Feel the power. I'll not be defeated. Get out of here. I am ready. I'll not get Let's <laughs> time for a break. Coming. Um anger and not. Thou didst fight his courage. Oh, that reminds me, Hunted can get a new ability now. Uh, pull arm attack, bow attack, or that's not great. Go pull arm. You can get all the treasures. Like I said, we're not really in any trouble here. Big mushroom. Never mind. I I'm said ready. nothing. Here's our bows. Well then. Is an ice mushroom, so rock cleaver, that's pretty decent. I do believe that is the area we need to go. I do believe we're gonna have a boss fight. This is all I need. A 
dragon. A dragon? This place is a dragon's lair? That's what I said. Why you drag these? I have heard the legends and master's tales too. But to see one in the flesh, I scarce imagined this day would cometh. But cometh it has. Ah, uh, yes. Did I ever tell thee about the time I went dragon hunting in the Clifflands? Four times now. And the tale getteth longer with each telling. Is that so? Mm. Uh, I suppose each time I remember more of the thrilling details, eh? Master. This world is not big enough for all the giant beasts thou hast huntedest. Huntedest? Thou believest me not, and yet I really, really did. What in the... stop in this! Why? Do I smell so foul? Tis not thy smell. Oh. Art thou blushing? Do I embarrass the... <sighs> Don't be a fool! <clears throat> if thou insistest, but listen in, my girl. Hunters fighteth many kinds of beasts, some so wondrous and astounding thou canst scarce imagine them. When thou art older, thou too will have tales that no one will believeth. But thou must still keep them. Some will haunt thy dreams. Some will make thee snorting with laughter whenever thou recalls them. <laughs> but let me tell thee this, Hornet. What is it, Master? Even when thy tale is so improbable and fantastic that not one man thinketh it the truth, thou canst tell it to me, and I will believe every word thou shalt hear in this tale master over and again until thou beggest me to stop just as thou didst to me so overconfident who's to say we're gonna win it's a dragon then so am i Hmm, well, it's time to find out the weakness. Rain and arrows up on me. Weak the arrows. I'll do my best. Um light. <laughs> Weak to light. I am ready. Pierce our foes. Let's do this! The power. Oh wait, I forgot to do the forgot to do the thing. He's huge! There we go. Uh Hanit? I'll do my best. Hanit's gone now. Well this won't be able to tell the tale. It's time. Ooh, big buffs. Oh, but we can't use magic unless.
Hanuk got swept away. Oh, there she is. Welcome back. Oh, he's almost already dead. Well, since we can't use abilities, thanks to the stupid... Uh, Garbage. My turn now. Bring about a miracle of healing. <laughs> oh no. Let me help. I am ready. Regen going. My turn now. She puts oh no on the soundboard. Would be spamming it. Alright, get out of here. She's back! My turn now. Uh let's get rid of Silence again. We capture it. Untamable. What a shame. Open back nothing. Cowering before the huntress. No, it's time. Oh no, now poison. Poison. Time for a break. I am ready. Nice try. Oh, 
Uh oh. Dragon's mad. It's okay. We'll, we'll trap him. Better than a snare. Slow on him. I am ready. And from here. able to break him with just rain of arrows or arrow storm well, that was very close that she missed one more time I guess that's a sign then. We could technically break him if we're completely lucky. Let's try it. A of arrows. No. Ah! Oh. Well then. We go. Let's do this. Just in time. Feel the power. I'll do my best. Huh? I am not made for such battles. No buffs. Unfortunately, even after four dances, is it so? Is it done? Have I slain a dragon? 
I mean, you didn't do much. Let's be honest. This must be the herb of grace. Now to leave this forest and roar. What the dogs doing? Come in, Linda. It's all right, Linda. The monsters are gathering here to eat the dragon. The dragon that had ruled this forest hath been slain. Not yet. They will not attack in us, not for a while yet. Come in, Linda. Susanna will been will been waiting word from us. Now that I have the herb, I can finally face Red Eye. And save Master from that dreadful curse. Found the herb, did you? Thou waited for me? Susanna only asked thee to show in us the way in. I have my own mind. A man can tarry where he likes, can't he? Of course he can. Anyway, I'm done tearing. Suppose I'll go on ahead. <laughs> I most appreciate your concern. <laughs> uh, well, I just... Uh... <laughs> What a strange man. Is a like sweet on a certain hunter? Well, sure looks like it. Oh, we can hear travel banter. <laughs> How charming. What uh, what art thou sniggering about, Primrose? That Alaic fellow, he surely fences you. What, thou speakest nonsense? He treateth me as Susanna bade him, as a guest of her home. Oh, trust me, I know men, the way he acted toward you. It wasn't anything like the way he acted toward the rest of us. But, 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 but. Oh, bless, look at you blush. Tell me, Hanit, what do you like in a man? I, uh, d d don't, uh, that is, um, Someone strong, stronger than me. <laughs> well, good luck with that. You might be searching for a long time. How long do you think this game is? No. Let's see, we've played for 44 hours. So we've got another 10 more. She is found the herb of grace, did you, child? I'll do what I can. Here, give it to me. It needs to brew for a spell before it'll work right. Work right. Work right. Thou hast my thanks. Thank thee. And then. So, how did it feel to slay your first dragon? Thou knewest it was there?
Listen, dear, if you couldn't slay that dragon, you wouldn't have a cinder's hope in a blizzard of surviving an encounter with Red Eye. You are... Thou... Thou art not a woman to co coateth her words in sugar, owl, art thou? <laughs> Never seen much point in it, my dear. Now why don't you tell me about that dragon while we wait for the herb to brew? Hmm. As thou wishest. Well, I never. So tell me, dear, how does it feel to tell the tale? Well. That was never much for talking. It was Master who taught me how to weave stories. <laughs> oh, that lad was a tongue-tied fool in his youth as well. Erm this and um that could scare, scarcely put two words together. <laughs> Surely he was not that bad. Indeed. Trust me, dear. What grain of eloquence he, eloquence he has now, he now possesses, was drummed into him by yours truly. Think twice before you tell him your tale. He might be jealous to hear you speak so beautifully. Well, well. Tis true that he doth not enjoy being shown up in anything. Hmm. Here you go. This should do the trick. You be sure to quaff it down in one gulp the moment Red Eye's foul curse strikes you. Thou hast my thanks. How oh dare! Too soon for that. You can thank me once Zanta is back to his old self again. Understood. Herb of Grace. You are Hanet? I am, and thou one of the Knights Ardant. At your service. I bear word from Lady Eliza. It is about the fiend, Red Eye. She hath found it? Yes, near the desert city of Marceline. She awaits you there. Then that is where I will go. Thank thee. If you will excuse me, milady. Taking your leave so soon? Yes. It is time. I apologize for any burden I may have caused thee. My pleasure, dear. There's always room under this roof for my favorite granddaughter. The burden of family is no burden at all. Thank thee. Looking after her, Alaic. You don't have to tell me. That is my duty, and it will be done. Indeed. Hannah, dear, for all your cleverness, you are as naive as a babe in the woods. You are a pretty girl, if not the beauty I was in my younger days. Hmm? But I will hold you up with my prattle no longer. Go in safety, my dear. Hmm? Eh? Eh? Thank thee. When the hunt is done, I shall return, and master with me. And so does Hanet leave still snow behind her. 
Her quest has now become a hunt. To save her master, she must slay the beast they call Red Eye. With this knowledge, she strides towards her next destination, the city of Marceline, surrounded by the sands of the Sunlands. All right. And so, we are now at the final chapters for everyone. So you guys get to decide who we, who we finish off first. We could do Primrose. By doing Primrose, uh, she's no longer locked in as the primary character. Octopath order. Primrose, Primrose. So we can finally get her out of the party. I guess we'll do Primrose last then. I would like to get to this area so we don't have to do it later on. to win. It's the wrong spell, but whatever. Still did the damage. It's been 15 hours of seeing Primrose all the time. We need more party variety. Uh, it's been uh, 45 hours, actually. Primrose has been our main character since the start. It's 45 hours of dancing. Snow lizards? I am ready. What are snow lizards doing here? Here's our foes. Okay. Oh, let's do this. Ah. I'll not be you must find us the weakness. The hunt beginning. Ah. I am ready. Let my arrow fly in truth. Weak to axe. No. Let your wounds be healed. <laughs> Let the hunt begin. Anger and noise, Tiger. I am ready. She doesn't have an axe. Um. Speed times two. Let's hit him with the ice.
save file said 15. I know. I, there's a clock right in the upper right corner there. What the dog's doing? Uh oh. I don't have. Don't have enough MP. Uh, you know what? Probably weak to fire. No. I am ready. Weak to wind. Coming if thou darest. Weak to arrow. Don't have enough. I dust have enough. Here I go. Here I go. Feel the power. I am ready. Watch me now. Let's dance. My items. Oh no. GP times two. Let's do it. Ah! Time for a break. Let the hunt begin it. Nice dance, thanks. But also, it was not a nice dance. Anger and axe. How weak the axe, really? Well, then. well, this should be enough. Cracked. Here I go. Everyone, another. Yeah. Time for a break. I am ready. What? Holding back nothing. Anger and love. Chop. Thou didst fight with courage. Ooh. Is that the shoot self in foot dance? No. It's fine, don't worry. It's all good. Now oh, the 15 is the the time. It's uh 316 in the afternoon. North Reach. Hello. This is North Reach, the northmost, northernmost edge of the land. That's actually pretty good. Try that. Probably some gear we can buy here. Possibly. The 
things are looking up. You wouldn't believe the deal I got on this ring. Oof, that fellow was desperate. Drove him right down till he was practically paying me to take it. Though I ran into a rough spot myself soon after. Had to sell it to a peddler of such things. Got a better price than what I paid for at least. I'll buy your nut. Uh, gray plums. Oh, there's plum M's. I could buy. Interesting. Pom pom. Oh, palms are good. Can't go wrong with palms. Good day. You know a man named Joshua? He's quite special to me. Hope he's doing well. Oh, Joshua's poem. Not for sale. What ho? My house, the great house of Byron, has a noble lineage. Not that many would know. It now, not that many would know it now to look at us, how far we have fallen. I even had to part with the precious ring that was our family's heirloom. It seems our great house will truly end with me. Oh, let's share what we know. Uh, what? Um... You say you've researched the history of my house? That is a rather curious sort of hobby. Yes, we may be fading into disgrace now, but at least the glory of our past will live on in perpetuity. What is that you say? No, no, surely not. But if what you say is true, then my great forefathers were, were lowly farmers working in the field? What? Farmers. How disgraceful. They, they managed to raise themselves up from such humble beginnings to be one of the great, house, great houses of the land. It would appear that I have been mistaken about some things. I thought that being born into nobility was a gift that was mine by divine right. But I was born into such a position because of the hard work and sweat of my forebearers. Effort, endurance, patience. That is what House Byron should be. I shall learn from those who came before me. I shall start over from nothing and show that I am worthy of as the first Byrons. After all, <laughs> oh, he changed his name. He's now Byron the Commoner. After all, I have nothing more to lose now. I feel quite oddly free, in fact. Purple chest. Platinum sword. Oh, that's not that great, though. It buffs the enemy. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Well met. I travel in search of tales and legends of noble dragons, and I might put them down in the book. Or I would, but my master has asked me to assist him in his own work. But cannot yet set out to investigate the three great dragons of this world. Sorry. Can I ask you to perhaps assist me in my research? 
I would like to know about the great dragons found in the Frostlands, the Clifflands, and the Highlands. I would be greatly obliged if you could do this for me. I really would. Here be dragons. What was that? Speed? Gotta go fast. Give that to Tressa. Or maybe double speed. She will be very fast. Doombreaker. It is longbow. Lots of crit on that. Ophelia could use that. Silent cape, platinum vests. Hmm. You random guy, what you got for me? Plum and grape, who cares? What do you have? Bunch of garbage. All right. Well, we don't need to be here. There was no reason. I just wanted to have the city so we can warp to it. So, who is, who is the octopath? That we're gonna do first. We can do Ophelia, we can do Therion, we can do Cyrus. I was gonna call him Albus for some reason. Uberon? We don't have an Uberon, we have an Ulbrich. We can do Haunt, we can do Primrose. Oh, we can't do Tressa because we don't have Grandport. We'll have to find our way there. Can't do Primrose. She must be in the party until the very end. I mean, she can stay in the party, though. No? I, I think it's proper to do Primrose first. Oh, well, now we don't have a choice. It has been decided. That's right, I had business here. You've come to Everhold in pursuit of Simeon, who revealed himself as the ringleader of the crows. Here, you soon find the stage that the stage has already been set. This story so far. In her hometown of Noble Court, Primrose brought down the second of her sworn foes. There, she was, al she was also reunited with her childhood friend, Simeon. He approached her tenderly, and what he bore was the gift of pain. Simeon's scarf unraveled, grasped in Primrose's fingers as she fell, laying bare the mark of the, cro of the foul crow on his neck. The friend she cherished, cherished so dearly was the last of her foes. The man who had brought, who had brought death to her father and ruin to her family. What motives could the man have for this vile deed? Primrose could not begin to imagine, but it mattered little, for her ultimate goal was clear. It would all come to an end in Everhold. So this is the stage for the final act. I fear it won't be a happy ending for you, Simeon. Alright, 
first we're gonna switch out we're gonna switch out Hanit um hmm let's so bring Elfin level 35 into the war master basically anyone who's who plugs in has to be the war master check out the town maybe the oh no we actually did do that another uh... yeah we already picked up most of this stuff here <laughs> what ho give me a roll any roll and i shall deliver a perfect performance my next star turn is that of Sokrath. yes yes the legendary knight no less but to play the man, I must know the man. Every little detail helps. Yet alas, he is mentioned only in a few ancient passages and described in none. What to do, what to do? Well, we know the song, so we'll share. Oho, an ode that sings of Socrates' deeds? Yes, yes, fascinating. In his time, the legendary knight, Sokrath, had no peer. He stood above all. He fasted, he trained, he walked the hundred pilgrimage. He, drew he grew stronger. His sinews grew tough as leather, his flesh like iron. Though blades cut his skin, he felt no wound. Oh, oh splendid stuff, this. Splendid. See here about the fasting, proof of his dedication, commitment. He was a hero maid, not born. I am Sokrath. Throw down your blade or die. I oh, beg your pardon. Twas the secret to his strength. You see, the me the manly resolve that lay at his core. To play him, I must find the same resolve within me. Fasting. I shall begin there. I shall become Sokrath. Thanks. Thanks be to you. Oh, it's 20,000. There you go. Hey! Hey! And who are you? Well, no matter. Just don't try to upstage me. You'll only embarrass yourself. Excuse me, kiddo? Yeah, basi basically. Basically? slip of the thumb. Uh, uh, Jesus Christ, a little slip of the tongue there. The thong. Slip of the thong there. <gasps> oh, woe is me. What is to become of me? They'll hang me from the rafters. 
The highlight of my show is a grand fighting spectacle. The rabble always goes mad for it. But my star fencer has run off. The gods know for what we for what reason, and without him, well. If the rabble don't get their bloody climax, there will be hell to pay. But who else could possibly take the role? No. Good day to you. Welcome to the Everhold Amphitheater. I trust you're here to enjoy a show. Yes. Show a show of blood. Actually, my kid, that's that stone. Ah, but our special guest has arrived. Welcome, welcome, truly fortune smiles upon me this night. The curtain is about to rise. I trust you will enjoy the show before you go on your way. Of course. I own this theater. I come from time to time to enjoy the crowds and the ambiance. Needless to say, I also pen the production we're putting on today. It's the tale of a young noblewoman's life. Not a particularly original topic, to be sure, but nevertheless. I did write it for you, Primrose. Lovely. How touching. But I'm afraid I came for a different kind of show. <laughs> Have you now? Have made it this far alive, it would seem you too have fortune on your side. Mm -hmm. Perhaps I do. But I think you will be feeling less fortunate when the time is when the night is over. Prepare to die, Simeon. <laughs> Such strong words. But I ask you, my dear Primrose, are you prepared for what awaits you? You have my deepest respect, Primrose. Truly you do. It is not an easy road you have chosen, is it? You're wrong. I, I have only walked the path I had to walk. Oh? Oh-ho now, is that so? Come now. But enough prologue, let the show begin. <laughs> oh, hark unto the tale of a girl pure and true, who in her all too fleeting life knew such misery as no other ever knew. Our daughter, our precious girl. Thank the heavens. She's healthy and whole. She has your look about. She has your look about her, my lord, and a cry as strong as your cry in battle. <laughs> this is good. She will need to be strong indeed. For the future of our house will one day rest upon her shoulders. <laughs> you ask much of a newborn babe. It is no wonder she cries so. Quite right. We will raise her to be a fine lady. Strong, kind, and just. One who will treat all she meets with respect and compassion. Yes. We will. Hmm. When she is a woman grown, we will fashion 
for her the finest suit of armor. Oh. And the fa and the finest gown as well. She must stand out on in the ballroom as well on the battlefield. After all. <laughs> oh my. Look, she smiled. <laughs> Even in her smile, she takes after you, my lord. Yes, she will be a strong woman one day. What? What am I doing? I cannot let myself be distracted by this... This mockery. I swear, who does that Simeon Oaf think he is? Playing with someone's heart like that. Well, I won't let him get away with it. You have my full support, Primrose. I appreciate it, but listen, Tressa. Hmm? I'm sure you'll find the right man someday, so please don't give up. What? No, wait, I wasn't... After all, not only are you pretty, but you've got a personality to match. Why, if I were a man, I'd marry you in a heartbeat. Hey, I was, I was being serious. Sorry, I couldn't resist. What? So this character's story in the play... It's mine, in nearly every detail, just as I thought. What is this Simeon thinking? Whatever it is, it's awful. Taking someone's memories and putting them up on the stage for all to see. It is, but he is a fool if he thinks I'm going to play by his script. He won't get his way. Good. And I'm going to be right by your side to make sure of it. Thank you, Ophelia. Upon my faith, it is good to have friends to lend me strength. There you go. Got something for me? Soul stones. Okay. I'd appreciate if you didn't do business in the theater. You sold, uh -huh. you sold that to me. I can see you have passion for what you do, but could you please show some self-restraint? This is a theater. Always looking for serving. a bargain. full bar off of one fight. I mean, he is under level, but still. Let's see what you 
got. I am ready. Oh, full white. My turn now. My turn now. Transfer rune into rest. All right. This should kill. Here we go. Big levels for Alfin. He also has 4,000 points, which we can use to get more skills here. Dagger attack. Staff attack. Thirty thousand in this economy. Let's take it. Want a tango, huh? Oh, the hell is that? Feel the power. I am ready. Here are those. Um, lightning? That's an ice sentinel, so probably fire. Big axe. Nice. It was fire. The flame guides us true. Hmm? Ah, purple chests. We missed out on so much stuff by not having Therion along. Should crack. Oh, weak to darkness. Let's do this. Feel the power. Well, then, weak to darkness. Here we go. You know. Nah, well. Thank you. And still two thousand. I am ready. Watch me now. The show is over. You know, now that Tressa has a hundred and thirty speed, uh, she's always starting first which is great but we could also do a combination with primrose where Tressa could steal from everyone but not if she goes first well she could but I'll do my best. oh well there's a free fight With the 
the grace of Seal Tiege. Bring it up. This calls for Yeah, so this should work. Got to do a bit more damage on this guy. fill our coffers here make a ton of cash but do we need a ton of cash that is the question let's see what you got to darkness as well. Well, ain't that convenient. Hmm, interesting. Maybe something we might do later on. Um... Yeah, we'll get it. We'll just uh, refresh everyone. Because this will break the thieves. Ophelia will break the. Uh, Bring it on. Or even. Uh, this calls for even Alfin can uh, break the back row, so. Well, then. Yeah, we should be more than okay. <laughs> now we get 75 back from everyone. What a good combination, holy cow. The flame guides us true. Tressa is such a battery, it's crazy. Because now you don't use items, so you save up on that. You can basically plumb basket every turn. What to do? Um, I guess we can collect again. Donate BP to uh, Philia. Don't want to kill. Here we go. Everyone's pretty banged up. No, oh, whatever. That'll do her. I'm Watch me now. Seal With the grace of Seal Teach. It will allow us to steal from go. everyone. I will defend, don't matter. Let's do 
I mean, it's 6,000. Get lost. I am not made for such battles. Oh, and Elfin is now. Now has 2,000 points, which allows us. But you don't have your divine skill? Eh? What? I can't believe that. How do you not have your divine skill? And we, we gotta have Alfin in the party a lot more. Inferno Amulet is probably for fire defense. Yeah, greatly reduces fire damage taken. I mean, if you knew if you, if you knew you were fighting a fighter a uh, fire monster, that would be very good. Father? Look. Look at me. <laughs> Father, look. Look at me. dancing very good why however did you learn to dance so gracefully my little lady i learned it from you oh it was really that i've been practicing for you father i see is that so and you have scraped your knees show me You've been practicing long and hard. This I can see. Primrose. Primrose, forgive me. For what, father? Aww. I've been too hard on you, my daughter. Burdened you with overmuch. Burdened you overmuch with my expectations. <laughs> do not worry for me, father. I am strong. And I will do anything for the glory of House Hazelheart. That is what I believe in. My reason for being. <laughs> you are a strong girl, Primrose. You do our family proud. But someday, you must find a cause of your own. A cause that will bring you happiness. I will always love you, Primrose. Dad! Father. Enough of this. I must keep moving. Little kids totally talk like that. I know. Because I was once a little kid as well. And I talk like that as well. Okay, they're all selling light stones, which is interesting. Buying or selling items is prohibited. You sold me that item. You know? Wanna join me? 44% Not a guide. That cleric costume suits you perfectly, ma'am. That's not a costume. the party grows larger. Open for fish. Oh, five guys. I am ready. Here's our foes. What to do? Feel the power. I'll do my best. If this our dare. Do my 
guides us true. Looking good. He's almost level 40. Father, no! Why did you have to die? Why did you have to leave me? Oh, woe is me! However am I go however am I to go on without you? Ugh. I have only done as my convictions bade me to do. I have no regrets. Oh. I thought you might say something like that. You're making this delightfully easy. Father. <laughs> you took my father from me. Not forgive this. And for that, Simeon, you will pay. <laughs> oh, Father. Hmm. Little lady, why do you cry so? No matter how dark the night, Look to the stars, and carry hope in your heart. You are... Who? Who are you? <clears throat> I'm coming for you, Simeon. My journey is nearly over. It all ends tonight. You alright? Alright, Primrose. Yeah, sorry. Shucks, Primrose. You're always charging forward with a full head of steam. Not looking left or right, staring straight forward at the goal in front of you. But sometimes, you gotta stop and take a break. Take a look around you. Perhaps you're right. There, I looked around. Now let's go now let's get going. Right behind you. Brightstone. It's probably for prevents terror. No, prevents blindness. Ah, whatever. Blindness is the least of our worries. Because we're mostly spellcasters, so. Flame, protect us. What to do? Money. With the grace of seal teach. Is everyone still alive? Thank you. I'll do my I think we failed the seventy percent. Here goes Guardian, 
That's what I'm talking about. Put a shirt on, you bum. Doesn't he know? No shirt, no service. Wait, there was a guy here. I know he was, he was our party member, Simeon. It's just like Abraham Lincoln. Would you be so kind as to not interrupt? This is one of my favorite scenes, you know. Perhaps you'd care to watch it with me. I saved the best seat in the house for you. No. I'll stand. You know what I've come to do. Come now. Now, now, let's not rush things. I've invited you for a reason. That's... Invited me? You tried to kill me! <laughs> I took care to stab you in just the right place that you could have lived or died. It's the uncertainty that makes for true drama, you see. If you had died, the play would have ended. But if you would lived, then the next act could begin. Hmm. I would have been satisfied with either, I, uh, with either outcome, of course. There are any number of ways to end a tale. But live you did. And now you have dutifully taken the stage to play out your role in this tragedy. Oh, he's a theater kid. Yeah, that's right. Theater Andy. <laughs> Such a delightful show. Let's not lower the curtain yet, hmm? Must you look at me with such a face? Are you not too an art? Are you too not an artist of sorts? Surely you can appreciate the beauty in all of this. The suffering, the pain that humans are capable of feeling, condensed into a few brief yet sumptuous hours. Theater is life, and life. Is theater. Surely you can see this, yes? Your life was a beautiful tragedy from the moment you were brought into this world as a squalling babe. How many times in your life have you felt blessed to be here? When has life ever seemed a gift? This world is nothing but pain, nigh beyond the point of bearing. Constant, inescapable darkness. I will tell you the only joy I have found in, li in my life. Watching the lives of others fall apart. The sweet fantasies that people imagine their existence to be inevitably crack, then shatter to pieces. I feel like it would be very, very, um, how do you say that? Like outstanding, like very uh, showboating. And I'd savor the tragedy of each and every downfall. Oh, because it is so delicious. That's how, that's how he would speak. That one moment. That glory, the glorious instant where I see a man, a woman, lose all hope. That is the only time I truly feel alive. Chew, yeah, chewing the scenery. Do you understand now, Primrose? An overacting. There we go. Your love for your father and his for you, it was beautiful fleeting thing but it was all 
the more beautiful to see it all come apart. That's right. I thank you, Primrose, for inspiring me so. You have lived all this time for the sake of your revenge. You clipped the left of my wings. And then the right. And now you stand before me, your true foe. Hmm. But do you not find yourself wondering what your father would say if he could see you now? Do you truly believe this is what he would have wanted for you? To throw away all your hopes and dreams for the sake of revenge. My father is gone. I don't think he'd be happy at all. I think he'd say this. Live not for me, for I am dead and gone. You must find your own happiness. Father. Primrose, will you dance for me once more? I wish to burn the sight of you into my memories, that it shall never fade. Yes, Father. She will need to be strong, indeed. For the future of our house will one day rest upon her shoulders. He knew. You haven't forgotten the debts now, have you? You haven't forgotten who owns you. It's a shame, Primrose. You were always my favorite. Quite the dancer yourself, in the end. Now we're going through all the memories. I know that deep down, you have a good heart. Primrose, you must find that faith in yourself. <laughs> I will send you to your father's side. Now to remain. Lady Primrose, what do you believe in? She will be strong. We will raise her to be a fine lady. Strong, kind, and just. Yes. It reminds me of the fire in your father's eyes when he faced his end. This man should not live a moment longer. Oh, I'm sorry. I heard that you were looking around for my friend here. And you know what they say about birds of a feather. Oh, the tragedy! It moves me to the depths of my soul! Exactly. He, he should have talked the whole way like that. But someday you must find a cause of your own. Let's punch my microphone. A cause that will bring you happiness. I will always love you, Primrose. has this all been for? But no. Father would understand. And this... This will be the end of it. When I plunge this dagger into your breast, it will all be over. I will finish this. Perfect. Yes, just perfect. 
The depths of emotion that burn in those eyes. That is the girl I fell in love with so many years ago. She was a child, man. A woman truly worthy of my genius. Now, come to me, Primrose. And let me bring this beautiful tragedy to a close. Time for the main event. It's huge. What to do? Feel the power. I am ready. Father marionettes and dancer. Oh, okay. Here's our Armor crush. Uh oh. I'll not be defeated. Well, obviously we're gonna have to dance. That's only proper, right? Dance while silenced. Goes first. Okay, she'll do that. I might as well find weaknesses. Lion death. Oh. My turn now. Here goes nothing. Funeral dance. I'm ready. Yeah. Watch me now. Curious. Oh, oh JP times five. That's pretty good. Ducky. This calls for surgery. Oh no. Well, we gotta stop him, so. Gotta stop him as well. Shucks. Um. Gotta get rid of the freaking poison here. Who's this bozo? Uh, the culmination, the final chapter of Primrose. The big, the biggest of the bads. I 
me? Shucks. Get rid of that. Yeah. Time for a break. My turn now. Let's summon the usher. All right. Very important. Bring it on. Hmm. What do we got? I am ready. What is he weak against? Yeah. Time to dance. What to do? Thank you. <laughs> Ninety one, and I missed. Thank you, Usher. I'll do my best. Staff. Let's do this. Thank you. It's only a thousand bucks. I'm ready. Um, oh, we got a killer. Here's our foes. Here we go. This clown remains. Feel the power. Bring it on. I'll do my best. Great bash. Spoiled with you there, Simeon. All right. Was expecting a bit more there. Well then. It's time to end this. Or. Ooh. Break the Elemental break. Oh, he's he is done. Here we go. He is done. Something's not right. This isn't enough. Not yet. We still haven't seen the full depths of the darkness inside you. Show me more, Primrose. 
Show me the darkest shadow in your heart. You hate this, don't you? You are full of regrets. I regret nothing. Damn! <laughs> Foolish girl. You think your father would be proud to see you like this? Bloodying your precious family heirloom for petty revenge? Tell me, have you even visited your father's grave? No. First, I must do what must be done. When I can look him in the eye and tell him he is avenged, then and only then will I go. My poor little Primrose. How you lie to yourself so. Can't you see that you're running away? You can't bear to face your father, to show him your blood-stained hands. This was never about avenging your father, was it? You were simply trying to fill the emptiness in your heart. But you couldn't accept that, so you twisted your memories of your father beyond recognition, until you convinced yourself that he would want this. <sighs> it's true, isn't it? You speak nonsense. How did it feel when you killed my men? Did that fill the hole in your heart, even a tiny little bit? Enough! Shut up! You can admit it, Primrose. You don't need to be strong anymore. Stop it! Just... stop. You have no place in my heart any longer. Father. Can I tell you something, Father? Something I've never told anyone before. The truth is... I hated it. I hated my life without you. I hated the loneliness. I hated not having you by my side. But it's almost over now. Freeport, we didn't defeat him. We defeated his chair. That's why. Please, Father. Forgive me. Come now, Primrose. It's okay. Abandon this madness, my dear girl. You don't need to lie to yourself any longer. That hard look on your face doesn't suit you. You know you were made for softer things. I am Lady Primrose of House Azelheart. And I swear on my ancestor's name. And on my father's blade. I will not lose faith. My faith shall be my shield against you! Time for them oh, to he's death. huge! I am ready. You thought there was only one fight! Silence. Here goes My only weakness. What to do? Feel the power. All right. Not sword. Dagger. Dagger.
Oh, we're gonna do some damage. Darkness. Here we go. Possibly oh, no. pole arm, yeah. Boys cracked. All right. Hmm. No, we keep going. Oh, no. Uh, new weaknesses, so probably sword. We're so already almost dead. Sword time. Let's do this. Unable to collect. Oh man, you're the worst. Feel the power. Ah. Get the boy out. Future denied. All right, let's get the time for a break. What the? The usher took the hit. Shucks. The true MVP. Dark rune on everyone. Shucks. I am ready. Watch me now. The big move. Unleash an elemental attack on all foes that deals damage proportional to the party's current BP. We are full bars. Stay aura. Shine upon us. The limit. Oh, I forgot about the limit. You 
call it you collected thirteen dollars. Okay. Okay. The vendetta coat. Bravo. Oh, bravo. I have seen the full depths of your heart. It was more beautiful than I could have ever imagined. And now, for our climax. Come, Primrose, and plunge your precious dagger into my breast. Every show must come to an end, Primrose. It is time to lower the curtain. And when the moon waxes full and bright in dark heaven, and stars glitter worlds away from earthly sorrow, would that sleep hold you in her soft embrace? Then shall my eyes close, lips open in prayer, for it is only in dreams that we may meet again. Goodbye. Simeon. Yes, Amber. My answer is yes. I am so happy, my love. My heart is free of all doubts. Let us never be apart again. Never again. We did it! We got the credits! So clearly the game is over now. We don't have to do the rest. Next game. Time for multi mahjong. That's the tradition. What was the game we got? Like three. Oh, it was um, Labyrinth of Refrain. Remember that? Remember Labyrinth of Refrain? Where we had like three credit rolls? What's another game as well? I don't remember. Just in time for One Piece Odyssey. I don't even know what that is. I've gotten four. Wow. It's over? It's right. No, it's not right. We just finished Primrose. Didn't you get the credits at the end of every chapter? Was it Revelations? Octopath Traveler releases February 24th, 2023. That's why we played this one. So we can jump right into the second one.
little did you guys know this is actually an Octopath Traveler stream. It's an all Octopath channel. used to play those pitiful classes. Oh, by the way, we're going to watch the credits for every single character. That's right, it's the new movie night. We can talk about David Ribs Carrillo. My ribs. I'm surprised we're seeing all the other characters. Doing away with Mahjong just to sandbag his heart out? I mean, that was the heart of the channel all along. We get to listen to the nice music. Jesus, this is long. It's a credit roll. The Super Smash Bros. Sandbag with Cat Ears should be the channel mascot. I don't think I've seen that. I know the sandbag, but not with cat ears. Rem remember when NES game credits were like 12 names and they were all pseudonyms? Yeah. Good times. Fishman. What the hell's a coup? Technical Q&A. Remember this guy? I don't think we killed him like that. No, I heard that they did that before, so the the like workers wouldn't get poached by other con uh, other companies. Actually, my formations. Yeah, because Spirit, uh, Rune Knight. I thought this was this was all random. These are actually my formations. Yeah. Oh my God! Even the ushers there, and they show how we killed the enemy. I thought it was random. The game remembered.
The game remembered. Hey, we did it! That's a nice touch. Yeah, I agree. Every copy of Octopath is individualized. That's true. Father. At long last, I can face you again. I did as you always taught me, Father. I found a cause I could truly believe in, and I kept my faith. Since the day that you were taken from me, I swore I would avenge you. And avenge you I did. And yet, even now that my long journey has ended, and I have done all that I set out to do. I am still a Why? traveler on the Octopath. Title Why drop. Does my heart still ache with this hollow pain. What am I supposed to believe in now? What am I fighting will for? Carry me on from here. But this is something I must find for myself. And until I do, I will keep dancing. Just looking at chat right now. Finn! We did it, boys! We got the Finn! You have completed this traveler's tale. You can now freely remove them from your party. Get the hell off my team! We did it, boys! Rimrose is finally free. Freed of the curse. But, unfortunately for you guys, the game is not over. We still got seven other guys to get their, uh, their final ending. And perhaps the real, true ending. We're going to take a small break. And we'll be back with more Octopath Traveler in a few minutes.